Last summer's drought hit one local park particularly hard, but heading into Memorial Day weekend, folks at Salamone Reservoir are putting that ready to put that past behind them. News Channel 15's Adam Widener has a look at a park full of optimism after being all dried up. Well, the beach behind me is open. The campsites are full. Any other summer, it really wouldn't be abnormal here at the Salamone Reservoir on Memorial Day weekend. But last summer, it was hit by extremely low water levels that created a lot of problems. So with the new year, has brought some new excitement to a summer that has to be better. It's a cool but calm day at the Salamone Reservoir Beach. Water levels are right where they should be and hundreds of campers setting up this weekend. Salmony's open for business, I guess you could say. But that wasn't the case last year after the worst drought in recent memory. Because of the drought, I was able to walk out here, which makes this place look like a desert. That was me in June of last year. The reservoir was down at least 14 feet, and I can walk out to one of those buoys way out there. You think, what else can happen? And you know, a couple weeks later, something else. Low water levels revealed Monument City. A blue-green algae problem actually killed two dogs. About as bad as I've seen it. In business? Our income was way down last year, probably 40 or 50 percent. But with water levels back to normal, there's a recurring phrase around the park. It should be another good year. I think it'll be okay this year. It's optimism leaving campers and boaters alike loyal to their formerly dry Huntington County Park. Best park in the state of Indiana. In Huntington County, Adam Widener, News Channel 15.